I was wondering, do you know anybody who would be interested in challenging Rhea Ripley for the NXT Women's Championship? Do we have to go through this every time we talk? Yes. Being a GM can be tedious at times. You must allow me my few available joys. Okay. Gee, Mr. Regal, I'd sure love a chance to face Rhea Ripley. I won't even mind if you're about to tell me that it isn't as simple as that and whoever faces Rhea will actually have to jump through a number of hoops to earn the title shot. I thought you'd say that. Well, it's not going to be that easy. Because, wait, what did you just say? Nothing. Just tell me what I need to do. Now you've taken all the fun out of it. Come on, let's try again. I assume there's just a sign-up sheet or something? Of course there's not a sign-up sheet. We can't just hand out title chances willy-nilly. They must be earned. This is a company-wide opportunity. We're going to set up a number of fatal four-ways in what I'm calling the road to Rhea. The winners of those matches will face each other in a final elimination four-way to determine who will take on Rhea Ripley for a championship. The question is, are you interested in getting on the road? Getting on the road. I like that. Thanks. So, are you interested or not? I'm in. I can't turn down a shot at a title, no matter how long the road is. I like the turn of phrase remarkably less coming from you. Here she comes. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making her way to the ring from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning, Sandra Brown. Some critics didn't believe her interest in WWE was genuine, but she demonstrated tremendous dedication at the Performance Center and drive to become a WWE superstar. The competition here is next level. If things take a wrong turn, she could be in a perpetual state of pain and kiss any remaining Hollywood dreams goodbye. some attitude and her new style suits her well a new tony storm and her opponents first from gold coast australia tony storm tony storm has spent years honing her craft carving her path to wwe by way of australia time spent in europe even in japan before arriving in nxt and making a mark Well, here comes the girl with the shiniest wizard. A competitor that's shown she possesses tremendous heart from bell to bell. A true inspirational superstar. And from the Welsh Valleys, TK Knox. 
Well, Tegan was betrayed by her former best friend, Dakota Kai, in the first ever women's War Games match. All that says to me is that Tegan Knox simply isn't a very good best friend. Saxton? Saxton? I was reading my comment. Saxton? Well, a feel-good story every time Tegan Knox competes. The war goddess. And from Dallas, Texas, Ember Moon. A woman who reinvented herself with her return to NXT and found a compelling ally in Shotzi Blackheart, winning the women's tag team titles. Ember Moon always game, always ready, always focused. The first competitor to ever win both the women's title and women's tag team titles in NXT. Something tells me Ember's Law is about to be served tonight. The road to Red begins right here on a series of fatal four ways to determine who will challenge Rhea Ripley for the NXT Women's Championship. Raquel Gonzalez, Tegan Knox, and Ember Moon are all big names in NXT, but the fourth superstar of this group can make a name for herself with a big win tonight. And for once, I'm from the middle rope. Oh, a splash! Well measured. Missed timing with that springboard. She's staying elusive. She's right across the face. Ooh, bullseye! Ouch! Connor finds a counter for Knox. Mark. Ouch. She is just desperately trying to fight out of it. Oh, look at that torch of their opponent. Oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, man. Snap headbutt. Oof. Just one step ahead. Oh, just in case the first few didn't hurt. There's another. She's feeling the hurt here. That was nasty. 
Storm dodged that attack. She's taking a beating here. This deep into a fatal four-way match, it's a wonder they're not more banged up. But the grueling nature of this match is definitely getting to them now, gentlemen. Look at this. Boom. Nice. She heads into the ring. Gets inside the ring. Put it down across the back. Suplex. From behind, a lot of roll takedown. Bridges back. This could do it. Shoulder up right away. Are you kidding me? Not even a one count. Storm's attack. Suplex. <laughs> and now there's an opening. <laughs> she adjusts it and reverses it. Ooh, kick to the face. She's in the ring now. Absolutely planet. Enough already. Beautiful reverse STO. Face first. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. Storm got out of the way. Extremely painful hold there. The submission is locked in. Tap deep. out coming. It's tap over. out coming. And she lets her free. But the damage was certainly done, Michael. Stomping down. Quick thinking pays off. in the gut wrench. All the way up there. She's starting to drag a little bit. Well, this deep into a fatal four-way match, you gotta expect to be a little worse for wear. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. DDT spike. Disagreed. You can see her struggling to find her bearings. Blast off. Big miss right there. A step up in Zagari. She's going up. Top rope here. You can tell she wants to put an end to this. She might be down again soon. And a sidewalk slam. Ember looks to line her up from the top. She wants to finish this. Perched up high. Ooh. Headed 
to the top now. Look at her stumble back up. Probably seeing double vision. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Out. And Moon is really dialed in. Storm needs to find energy and fast. Look out! She's climbing to the top turnbuckle. You can sense what her intentions are here. Storm turns it around. Cody Storm kick to the gut. Arms hooked. Oh, zero. That could be Curtis for Moon. Superstar standing in this matchup. Defeating these three opponents is a real accomplishment for her. Yeah, they made her win. She's in a fighting mood tonight. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making her way to the ring from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning Sandra Brown. She says the thrill she gets from competing in the ring just hits different than being in movies. And her future is in WWE. If she's not on her A-game tonight, it will hit different. And I guarantee she won't like it. Such an incredible journey for this woman. But she knows a win tonight will take her even further. Uh, here comes the evil. Genius of the sky. Genius being the operative word. And her opponents, first, from Tokyo, Japan, Io Shirai. One of the most decorated competitors in Japanese women's wrestling history. And Io Shirai has continued that success in NXT and WWE. Io Shirai, without question, possesses one of the best mood salts in all of WWE. And if we're lucky, we'll see another one here tonight. The genius of the sky preparing to take flight.
Gentlemen, are you ready? I think Dakota Kai is about to get her kicks. I see what you did there. Look at that intimidating scowl. Byron, you look scared. I am scared. And from Auckland, New Zealand, Dakota Kai! Ruthless attitude and ruthless kicks. Half of the first ever NXT Women's Tag Team Champions. You know, it's hard to think at one time Dakota Kai was the captain of Team yeah, at one which, time, Byron, at one time. That included the entire WWE Universe. But how things have changed. Dakota is no longer the captain of Team Kick. She's the leader and the ruler of Team Kick. And Saxton, you're off. Canada's greatest expert has arrived. And... From Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Trish Stratus. Trish Stratus always hungry to take on the best of the best. Always hungry to take on the absolute top competition in WWE. Stratus faction guaranteed. Now, 
Absolutely not. Oh, wow. Uh Slap. Uh-oh. Here it comes. She catches Kai with a big count. See here. Uh oh. Submission maneuver locked in. Well, well, you have to question this decision. And now she's getting back Dakota to the break. Kai has been eliminated. Pulling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. Pull right back in. Side slam. Ooh. I think this is the most opportune time to be looking for the fans' praise. That offense really hitting her hard. Yeah, this fifth quarter has certainly taken its toll, Michael. Oh, what a kick! And again to the back of the head! Stratus needs to figure this out. Trish needs to reassess her strategy. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Able to reverse that one! Boston crap. A win via submission. Stratus is out of here. The elimination has been eliminated. Wicked forearm. And Eo is in a daze. It could be the end for her soon. Eo over the fender. And another counter. Hold on. She could be looking for a submission move here. Octopus stretch locked in. I don't know what choice she has except to tap out here. She's gonna have to tap. I right, tap out. Gets the elimination and the win. Here is your winner, stunning Sandra Brown. An absolutely thrilling fatal four-way win here tonight. Yeah, with an elimination match, your number can be up at any moment but they've managed to outmaneuver all the other competitors here tonight. Congrats. You look better than I expected. Thanks. Still not good enough to defeat me, though. I don't even know why we're going through the charade of this match. Because I want your championship. And I want to listen to nothing but metal in the locker room. But sometimes we end up with EDM. Point is, even I don't always get what I want. With that being said, I'm more than happy to defeat you in the ring if you don't mind the embarrassment. Big talk from a big fraud. Watch your back, in and out of the ring. I'm not running, but trust me, you should. Am I concerned? Of her? Come on. She talks a big game, but everyone knows that's all it is. Talk. If this Yobbo is the best competition they can find to face me, I'll be holding the NXT Women's Championship for a very long time. You're not worried about your opponent having any extra motivation? She's endured so much already by making it this far down the road to Rhea. She's fighting for a championship. She shouldn't need extra motivation. And like you said, she's already had to win two matches just to get this far. Even if she was rested, she'd be a long shot against me. But she's tired and worn down. So it's only a matter of time before her road to Rhea ends with a terrible and violent collision.
And there you see the NXT Women's Champion, Rhea Ripley, fresh off her strong statement. Wait, it's the challenger from behind. Now she must not have appreciated what Rhea said. We're going to see the walls come down here. This is out of control. I don't like the looks of this. I don't either, Corey. Not one bit. The backstage area is no place to settle your differences. Oh, man. Ooh. Reversal. What a counter. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights out. Breaker. <laughs> Looks like setting up for a suplex. Looking to finish things off. Ripley gets her back. Attack to the midsection. Oh, my Lord, through the table. She anticipated that one. Oh, wow. Boom, right to the jaw. Oh, oh you could pick up your teeth in section 112. Making that shoulder a priority. Ripley sidesteps the attack. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights out. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. Able to get out of the way. Caught with the boot. Strong oh, kick. My goodness. Oh, man, right to the esophagus. Tied. Oh, yeah, she is really getting fired up. Straight punch. Ah, jumpy DDT. My. Oof. And the assault to that area continue. Going for it. Looking for the LaBelle lock. And she releases the hold as she feels that enough.
following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Women's Championship. This woman is the real deal. The champion is coming in very confident, but she must remember what the opposition is capable of. The champion must be all business or else we can see the crowning of a new NXT Women's Champion here tonight. A lot of pressure on this woman. Tonight is where she needs to prove that she's championship material. Now the nightmare is real. Rash, bold, and unashamed. Brutality has arrived. You know, Rhea Ripley's got to be the billboard example when it comes to stealing headlines in your debut. Remember, Rhea Ripley won the Raw Women's Championship on the greatest stage of WrestleMania. Now, you're absolutely right, Byron. Rhea Ripley is not afraid of any competitor, no matter how impressive their resume may be. Sent a message to the entire world in the 2017 and 2018 May Young Classic tournaments. Introducing the challenger from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning, Sandra Brown. And introducing the champion from Adelaide, Australia. She is the NXT Women's Champion, Rhea Ripley. Desire and resolve will be tested tonight, all for the right to claim the championship. Welcome to one of the most exciting nights of WrestleMania weekend NXT TakeOver and one of the most heated matches on the card. The rivalry between Rhea Ripley and her opponent has definitely reached a boiling point, Michael. Ripley's defending her NXT Women's Championship against a fierce challenger who's been taking the fight to Ripley for weeks. Take down, look at the cross face. Oh, what a cross face. Trouble in trouble. Tap out, she's got to tap out. She's going to get hurt. Seriously hurt. The jeopardy is real. Tap out. Fighting desperately. She rolls her way out of the submission and takes control. German suplex. Land neck first. Ooh, what a forearm club. Firm control. And that one misses the ball. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights 
kicks out. The champ getting put on the back foot here. Rhea capitalizes there. Two handed cover by the champ. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. She still has enough energy for a simple kick out. Kick again in the back of the head. As the leg trap, Fisherman suplex. She's being prepped for something. Power from the suplex. Control. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could one, be here four. all day. Power. I think you're right. She was clearly waiting for that. All right, she's back in, ready to go. a little worse for wear now. And she's stunned in the corner. Rhea was just a step behind there. Super kick, a double super kick. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. To the outside. This could get wild. Ooh. Two. Two handed jokes. Oh, that one coming. Three. Rhea ducks into the ring post. Here we go. The challenger dodges Rhea's attempt with a kendo stick. This is what I was hoping to see between these two. But this isn't unsanctioned like their last encounter. It should be. And there it is. The referee has thrown out the match. I don't think they care. These two are going to keep fighting until one of them can't continue. That's enough. That's oh, enough. broken loose at NXT TakeOver. William Regal and a horde of referees doing their best to stop him. Good luck. When cooler heads prevail, I think the challenger is going to regret the outcome here tonight. Hey, Rhea Ripley was the first to go for a kendo stick. Either way, this is going to end in a disqualification. Her opponent has a legitimate claim for a rematch. We'll have to see how that shakes out, but at least it looks like the fight between these two is finally under control. Yeah, for now at least. He's had enough. You've sent your message. Come on, stop. I gather you have a complaint. Yeah, I've got a complaint. Rhea should be stripped of her title. What she pulled last night was completely out of line. Unbecoming of a champion, if you ask me. I didn't, and as I recall, she wasn't the only one who attacked her opponent with a kendo stick. She attacked. I defended myself. There's a huge difference. Unfortunately for you, in this case, that difference exists mainly in your mind. This is insane! I agree. This whole rivalry between the two of you has grown to outsized proportions. I've discussed the conflict with Mr. McMahon and Triple H. They both agree with my brilliant idea to hold a rematch this weekend. This weekend? At WrestleMania? Indeed. And to guarantee a victor one way or another, it will be false count anywhere. 
It's about time you gave me the spotlight. Now I'm going to win Rhea's championship on the grandest stage of them all. At the very least, you'll try. Best of luck. And let's leave the weaponry at home this time, shall we? No promises. The following contest is a Falls Count Anywhere match and is for the NXT Women's Championship. One of the best competitors in the women's division. It's a big fight feel here tonight as the title is on the line. And title matches like this have a way of getting your blood flowing unlike any other match. You are looking at a woman at the top of her game, ready to compete for that title. Now the nightmare is real. Rash, bold, and unashamed. Brutality has arrived. Well, the nightmare has come to WrestleMania. Feels like yesterday that Rhea Ripley made her WrestleMania debut, becoming the first superstar to defend their NXT Championship at the Showcase of Immortals. That night, she did so against Charlotte Flair. Well, how about WrestleMania 37 when Ripley called her shot, challenged Asuka, and defeated the Empress for the Raw Women's title? I'm sure there are many more WrestleMania moments in store for the career of Rhea Ripley. Introducing the challenger from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia. Stunning, Sandra Brown. And introducing the champion from Adelaide, Australia. She is the NXT Women's Champion, Rhea Ripley. Intensity on the face of the champion. Challenger in the corner, looking more determined than I've ever seen. Just when we thought the rivalry between Rhea Ripley and her opponent couldn't get any hotter, leave it to WWE management, including Mr. McMahon and Triple H, to pour gasoline all over it. That's right, Corey, and that's why we're here at WrestleMania for a Falls Count Anywhere match between the defending NXT Women's Champion and a challenger who will stop at nothing to win Ripley's title. 
This match may have started at NXT TakeOver, but we have a better stage to finish it than the grandest stage of them all. Ripley avoids the attack. A counter answered by another counter. Absolutely planted. Kick lands. Oh, Ripley put a stop to that. Look at this, going counter for counter. Fisherman suplex. The effects of this match are showing on the champ. And with the falls count anywhere stipulation, you have to be extra careful as you get more and more worn down. in the corner. Yeah, put right in the jaw. Stops Ripley's attack. <laughs> Suplex. Right, what started many weeks ago and got derailed at NXT TakeOver is finally finished here. And how fitting a moment. A title win is always emotional, but there's just something special about doing it on the grandest stage of them all. This road to Rhea and subsequent detour to WrestleMania was certainly unconventional, but none of that matters now. All that's important is NXT has a new flag bearer who looks poised to go on a long and dominant run. I agree, Corey. Whether you approve or disapprove of how she got here, our new NXT Women's Champion has etched her name in history and proven she belongs among the very best.